welcome back to our Wednesday vlogs. We are uploading twice a week now on a Sunday as usual and also on a Wednesday with a vlog. Um, obviously we've not been able to get up to anything too wild and exciting but we thought we'd put together some clips from the last week in isolation and what we've been getting up to um sort of just day to day things really uh, i hope you enjoyed our buying outfits for each other challenge on sunday and um, that was really fun to film and we're definitely going to try and stay creative throughout this whole situation um and do challenges and film our videos to the best ability that we can and um, being separated from each other obviously it's not ideal but we're going to work with it as we've said before if you do enjoy this vlog then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe so we just had a nice delivery arrive and um, it's not clothes for a change jeff it's a basket of fresh fruit and veg where did you get it from mum northern veg or something northwest fruit and veg we've got a range of things you've got some oranges apples bananas um mushrooms pepper leek spring onion cabbage who knows what we're gonna make potato oh pineapple yeah supporting local businesses you know in this weird time for them oh, a lettuce she got everything okay so i'm just doing my makeup now because hannah and i are actually about to film a video which probably will have already come out by the time that you're watching this um but yeah i'm just doing my makeup at the moment and i thought oh, while i was getting ready i might as well sit down and have a little chat with you all um i've just put my foundation and conceal on i'm just gonna put a bit of um this contour on you will have seen this in the video where hannah was trying to do my makeup um while she was blindfolded i think at the moment like i've only had like one day where i found myself feeling really bored so that's good so far um i mean i don't know how it's going to be in a couple of weeks when probably going to be still in lockdown i'm sure by then i will have lost the plot something i'm actually finding really amusing while being in lockdown is seeing all these lads try and give themselves skin fades and shaving their heads and stuff i do think it's very funny like is it better to trust someone else in your household to give you a skin fade or to shave your head or is it better to just do it yourself i feel like i would trust myself probably better than anyone else to do it at least in your, you would know in your head what you wanted to do i actually started watching makeup and um, girls on youtube when i was in year seven um i remember there was one girl that i just watched religiously um and I used to write down like everything that she said in her videos that she used. I used to write it down in a little notebook and I'd go to Boots on the weekend um, and I would buy like everything that she had recommended. My lashes have all come off now, um, which is sad. I really want them done again because I love having my lashes done. It's just so nice. You don't even have to bother with mascara. Right, I'm going to put my highlighter on now. Maybe I should try and do a different accent. What's my best accent? I can't really do any very well. Geordie. So now I'm going to put on my highlighter and this is done now. I'm going to put this on the tip of my nose and uh, my cupid's ball in my inner corner. <laughs> I'm so bad at acting. Excuse the hair and the face and the eyes. I'm so tired. I'm having like a chilled day today. I've been watching a bit of Gossip Girl. I'm just doing, I've got an assignment due tonight. So I'm just making the finishing touches. Yeah, if anyone's interested, this is my lovely poster that we've made um, about bilingualism in the UK and whether or not you should raise your child to be bilingual. Yes, you should. It's a good idea to learn another language. I wish I was fluent in another language. Um, yeah, so once this is submitted, all I have then, well, not all I have, but I just have three big essays due for like the end of term. Jeffy! Jeffy! Do you want to say hi to the camera? Jeff's a bit poorly today, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Cute though. What's going on? Don't lick me. What's going on? Say hi. Say hi, boss man. Say thanks for watching. 
not interested. So for anyone that follows Steph Elswood on Instagram, she does these like dance classes called Stay Sassy and um, you normally like pay to go to like the dance classes but obviously because Corona she's doing them online. So I thought I'd join one, it's like an Instagram live. Well, anyone that knows me knows I cannot dance. And she's expecting me to do this. <laughs> I'm gonna try. Um, I don't think I'll show you because uh, I really can't dance to save my life. Are you ready? To be honest, I'm just think I'm the next. Maybe I should go on um, the world's greatest dance or something. Just so good. So I've decided to make the tea tonight. So I was, we were gonna have um, chickpea veggie, like veggie chickpea burgers, um, but they're in the freezer and you have to defrost them for 24 hours. So the plan has changed, and I've decided now I'm gonna cook a quiche. I have a quiche it is a let's see what we've got here it is a salmon and broccoli quiche and um, we've had this before and it's really nice so i'm going to turn the oven on stick that in the oven and then i'll show you what i'm going to make with it i mean it's not very interesting but i just thought i'm making tea i might as well show you my kind of typical meal okay so now i'm going to make some i'm just going to chop some veg um i've got broccoli leek um some pepper um, and then some spinach so um, i'm just going to prepare the veg um, and then i'm going to fry that in a bit with some olive oil um, and some herbs etc and then i've also got we've got this um basmati and wild rice whole grain um rice so i have a bit of that and then we've got this five bean salad so we're gonna have some some quiche and then i'm gonna do like a rice veg bean salad mix thing just rolling with it do you know what i mean okay so i'm just frying the veg and i've added in oregano lemon juice um olive oil salt and pepper okay so this is the rice the beans and the veg looks lovely i think and um, with the seasoning that i showed you before and then this is the quiche which looks also lovely so i'm gonna cut that and serve it on a plate and that is my dinner yeah it's just kind of a typical thing that i would normally have like rice and veg um normally maybe i'd have like a piece of fish with it or poached eggs something like that but um yeah tonight this was the dinner of choice so i hope it's as nice as it looks what are you doing Hello. What? what are you doing? It's quite rude to have headphones in. Ice and what flavour is it? Orange and coffee. Mmm. I don't really, is it very coffee? Because I don't like coffee, so. Yep, yeah, mum, that's fine. Just tuck in here. Yeah, so. Don't put the knife in your mouth. It's not a knife. A misguided order um, has just arrived. I thought I'd ordered like loungewear, but. It's kind of not really lounge work, but I'll just show you what's in the bag. You know, I'll do a mini haul. And um, this little black top was in it. Just like a comfy, casual, you know. Just good for like with joggers when you're just around the house wanting to look casual, you know. And then I just got this little top. I like having like small tops, like short top crop they're called crop tops aren't they i like having crop tops because like a baggy top sometimes with like joggers i just feel a bit like you know um but this one's quite cute a nice little like i don't know if you can see like a mauvey purpley gray kind of color um little frill bottom edge yeah that's cute and then also got this like um little black kind of it's like fleece material but um a shirt yeah, so I don't know if you can see, it's like a cropped, kind of like fleecy shirt. Kind of cute. Um, these dogs are like so unflattering, <laughs> like huge. Um, yeah, cute for like going on a walk or um, just like around the house, I suppose. Just doing a nice spot of 
sunbathing it's so warm i'm actually like getting a little bit too hot um and yes i have decided to keep these sunglasses that hannah got me in the last video um i quite like them they're, they're nice but yeah um just sitting on this like chair catching some rays um i'm gonna do a little workout in the garden again like i did on last week's vlog um and then I'm going to go on my walk later on today because it's really nice weather. I think it, there'll be a really nice sunset, so I'd rather go later on. I might go on a run, actually. Currently trying to do some uni work. Um, look how many tabs. Look how many tabs I have open. I can't be bothered. And there's literally going to be so many more because I need to find loads of readings. Um, but yeah, I'm doing an essay at the moment all around Fox News, which is quite interesting, to be fair. I think I'm quite lucky with... With the essays that I get to write, like with my course, it is interesting. So even though I don't like writing essays, I could be writing it about something a lot more boring, I suppose. Although I need to do my dissertation, I haven't even really looked at that. And that is going to be the boring one. Um, but we're getting there with this essay. It's only 1,500 words, so I'm nearly halfway through. So getting there slowly but surely. Um, but yeah, this is the boring part of isolation i mean not that any of it's like really really fun but um it's one thing sunbathing and doing workouts in the garden it's another thing sitting doing uni work so i'm just at the hairdressers i think i might go a bit short you know like mix it up i think it's my fringe that's the issue at the moment it's like a weird length i'm just gonna try and cut some of my hair off if it's wonky i'm gonna be fuming <laughs> yeah but it's that long and you're not going out. Nobody yeah, true. You're not going to be able to notice it. Right. <laughs> Is it a lot? I might have done more than an inch. <laughs> that was quick. Normally in there, just as for like 40 <laughs> minutes. Oh, today again. <laughs> Don't take too much of the back, dear. She'll know how bad it is. Is it bad? <laughs> no, it's not. It's dreadful. Right. Um, that's quite a lot, actually. Mm -hmm. It doesn't look hugely different, but I think Mum's done quite a good job, and I would return to her hair salon. It just looks like a little bit shorter, a little bit neater, you know? The fringe is something we can work on, but I don't think either of us are qualified enough to be like cutting my fringe. Um, cute. I feel like it could have been like a more drastic lockdown hair change so i'm kind of happy with it just a little bit cut off. okay so my favorite series at the moment is power i'm just about to watch an, an, another episode I, i'm addicted like it's actually a problem because once i like a series like, i can't stop watching it but this one is really good if you haven't seen it obviously i'm a little bit late to the party um like i'm on season two which came out like a few years ago i think i'm not sure the exact years but i know that the last series was last year or this year um there's like six seasons i'm only on series two but um it's so good yeah so if anyone else watches it leave a comment because i need to discuss it it's one of them that like after you watch an episode you need to like vent to people who have seen it and be like oh my god what just happened i kind of wish i'd watched it at the time that it came out so that i could look onto it and see what everyone was saying but now i can't search anything about it anywhere because i don't want to see any spoilers so but yeah, that's what I'm about to do. Watch another episode. Oh, I think I've got it in my eye. Hi. Show me a new look. Um, I'm just doing a quick face mask before bed. I'm going to watch some Gossip Girl. Um, and just chill out. Living the life, really. Um, my skin is so bad at the moment. I don't know why. Because I've not really been wearing makeup. I've not really been eating that bad. Like, But around my chin, I've got the spots. So I'm trying to you know, get rid. Um, but I hope you've enjoyed this week's vlog. Um, we've been trying to do as much exciting stuff as we can. But obviously uh, in lockdown, it's more difficult than normal. But we're trying. Um, yeah, I hope you're all staying sane. Staying safe. Um, and hopefully this will all be over soon. But yeah, see you on Sunday.